Howdy campers. Uh, welcome to Figueroa Mountain Campground. Uh, you may wonder why I'm wearing a shemag. Because uh, the bugs are terrible. And they just left at my bug spray, bullfrog. Uh, which works great on southern mosquitoes, but apparently not so great on California flies and other they're everywhere so the hat and the shemag is helping keep them off out of my face uh, let's take a look around the campsite shall we uh, there's the tent to stand with my war bonnet traveler hammock and my wise owl um, under quilt and uh the snake skin has pulled up that gray thing in the corner. Uh, that's uh, some kind of bug screen. Uh, yeah, it's, it's a Amazon bug screen. Uh, gold armor. I had the same brand tarp, which I wasn't going to put up because I'm the only one here. But someone just pulled in looking for a spot, so I may have to have some privacy. At least when I'm changing clothes, maybe. What do they expect? It's a campground. There's the bike. The bike is doing well-ish. Um, it needed oil on the way up. Luckily, a local Ace store uh, carried my... Uh, uh, shell, some kind of shell, oil, Rotella tea, uh, sometimes I, when I change oil, I use bike oil, sometimes I use the shell Rotella tea, because it's really good oil, and it works fine in motorcycles, um, a little disconcerting to get up here and realize you need oil. And it was fine just like yesterday. So I don't know if the high heat on the road here or the up and down the mountains or what the dealio was. Something that did not like. Uh, also the road here uh, starts off okay. Uh, nice two lane through uh, horse ranches and farms and pretty countryside rolling hills and then it gets uh, more twisting and narrow than our road which is saying a lot um, but uh, at least our road has been paved within the last five years or so this one has not been paved in about 40 um, so I lost uh, my bike thermometer and two fillings I think um, I went into town got the oil had some lunch a very very late lunch at the uh, Mexican place in Santa Inez um, but on the way back I found my thermometer in the road and it appears to still be working, although I've, there's like six pieces i got to try to put back together. But I'm amazed I found it and a car hadn't gone over it, which I've seen one car, I think. Uh, I don't know, just as I was pulling into the campground, four forestry service trucks were leaving. I guess they count. Um... Not much traffic up here. It's really nice. Uh, so, oh, after the bumpy, crappy roads, it widens and smooths out its newer road. But then it narrows into one lane uh, once you get into the forest, the national forest, and uh, narrow, twisting, blind corners. Uh, but at least it's not torn up and bumpy so uh, I can live with that it's uh, 
you ever come up in the springtime, you have to be really careful because that one laid road is going to be crawling with uh, tourists. Ah! Sorry, uh, bugs. Uh, tourists taking pictures of the wildflowers because this is the place to come for wildflowers. Not this place, but this place. Um, so, yeah, uh, can't remember the name of the Mexican re restaurant. It, it's a fancy place, a re uh, Mexican restaurant and tequila bar. And they had a billion tequila, uh, tequilas and some really impressive looking mixed drinks. And uh, I had iced tea because I didn't want to ride this crazy road. Uh, under the influence of tequila. Now that I'm here, I may open up something. First thing I'm going to open up is uh, Nitro Cold Brew Starbucks because I'm exhausted. Um, oh, the Mexican restaurant I had, uh, what did I have? Uh, tostada, steak tostada, which was delicious. But it was like three o'clock by the time I had lunch, and uh, I, I'm not going to be hungry for a long time, but for supper, I stopped at one of the fancy San Inez or wherever the heck I was, a little deli, uh, it's not San Inez, Los Olivos, I think, Panino. I've paid too much for pepperoni and cheese and yogurt. Chobani black cherry Greek yogurt. Exciting, huh? Um, so that should hold me till breakfast. Um, I'll probably have uh, one of the camp meals. Uh, I think I got scrambled eggs, pour water in. Let it sit, sit for six hours and it uh, rehydrates and you have a tasty meal. Um, sometimes I'm just not hungry other than my coffee. Uh, if that's the case, I'll uh, ride into town and grab something on the way maybe. The uh, It's really nice and quiet because... Just before I hit the record button, the uh, camp host turned off their their generator, which had been running all day. And I can handle, I, I've slept through concerts, bike rallies, revving motorcycles, drunken revelry, which I can't sleep through that anymore. Drunken revelry. It, drunken revelry just pisses me off. Uh, depends on where I am. If I'm at a bike rally, you expect it, but not at a camp rally. And but even worse than all that is generators. I hate generators. I can't sleep with them. I've started carrying earplugs just in case. And uh, it's like somebody may have set up camp over there. Feel it? I gotta wear clothes. <laughs> anyway, that's our Figaro mountain adventure and the quick rundown. Um, I'm gonna have this now. I'm gonna put my dinner back in the cooler and uh, enjoy the evening. I hope you do too. See you next time. Have a great apocalypse. Bye.